You know, it was my first experience. It was like falling in love for the first time. I really learned everything through the show. I'm Liz Parker, and five days ago I died. After that, things got really weird. When you first heard that they were remaking Roswell, mm -hmm. what was your initial reaction? I mean, when you first hear they're doing it, it's almost a little shocking. Like, all, you know, to the fact like you're like when they're doing Charmed or any of these bigger shows, you're like, I understand. Then it's sort of flattering. Oh, you want to bring Roswell back? Then you start to hear the take and you're like, this makes sense. Mm -hmm. They're definitely modernizing it. Every small town has a story, but my hometown has a legend. It's pretty wonderful to come back and sort of be like, wow, 20 years later I'm directing. I've really grown a lot in this business. Okay, let's try it again. Rolling, rolling. Here we go. Definitely feels as full circle as something can be to be giving Janine direction and saying like, my Liz would do this. How would your Liz ask masks to dance? This is Liz Orteco, you know, and she's Mexican American and um, she is a provider and a caretaker for her family. and. Her dad is undocumented. These are also older people, you know, we're not looking at like high schoolers now, we're looking at people in their, you know, late 20s, yeah. early 30s, and life is much more complicated. Life has been hard on them. Everything I've ever done has been to protect Isabel and you. Everything you've ever done has been to protect yourself. You know, her version of Liz is 10 years older than my version of Liz. So my version was very naive and very vulnerable. And she's very much a strong woman that knows what she wants, who happens to be in a similar situation. Mm -hmm. She's really created her own character and her own Liz. I need answers. So they start off with a lot of the similar like story beats. Liz gets shot, Max saves her life. No, no. And then they're presented with this otherworldly discovery, this, you know, absolute beacon of hope. But then very early on, it becomes its own show. Our show's about otherness. It's about feeling alien. And there are so many versions of that. I can show you, but I need to touch you. Okay. Thank you.